So I finally have a car mount, which means my hands are finally free. Uh, I just got off of work and it's pretty freaking windy. Like legit, it's bad. Look at this guys. I cannot wait. My next appointment is April 24th. And it is, oh, it's getting dark. Um, and it's April 12th, so I'm excited for that. I can do this on my own. Hey. Someone watching it. Morning! Your bus is here. Your bus is coming. Oh God, Give me a kiss. Bye. Bye. Love you. Bye. Bye, everybody. Good morning, Home Biscuits. I am going to vlog before I take off from dropping off Mr. CJ, but do you guys notice something different in my face? <laughs> it broke my glasses but I have an appointment today for eye contacts and I ordered a new pair of glasses because this was literally the last pair that I have that I haven't broken and yeah so today's actually gonna be a very busy productive day I do have to do some work some media work um, later on tonight for a show and um the little kids are like what is she doing um and i have to do that uh late night but i am gonna probably hang out with my mom if she doesn't have to babysit my niece because we were gonna go to costco they have a sale on some tvs um i was also editing this morning believe it or not i woke up really early i couldn't go back to sleep it was like 4 30 in the morning so i just decided to edit which i'm probably gonna regret later today when i um at work uh, later tonight and yeah and I have to stop by my school to pick up um, a more professional camera so I can take pictures of the event because we need those for marketing yeah so today so today's gonna be a very productive day at least that's what I'm hoping for but the reason I brought up editing aside from telling you all that I woke up at the crack of dawn is because I was noticing that some mornings I wake up more swollen than others and you'll notice that in some of the videos and I wanted to share that because I think it's interesting like that day um, that I was talking I can't even remember what I was talking about or what day I was vlogging but I was uh, basically like it just looks huge I mean it still looks huge here but that day was just really like on an extra solon type of thing so yep that's that it is nine o'clock in the morning and I've done a lot of grocery shopping and I haven't I just spent a lot of time at the store but I did buy um some stuff that i've been wanting to get and i'm just opening the blinds here don't mind me so i can get some nice lighting oh and by the way i ended up putting my lamp that was in mr cj's room so um yeah i'm gonna show you what i got i went to superior groceries which, which is uh right by my house i don't know if they have these honestly outside of socal i i, I don't know um, anyways, I got some meat, some ranchera meat, which is um, beef loin flat. I've got some pork longaniza. I just got two cans of tomato sauce. I got some queso fresco. Got some tomatoes in there. I got some more cheese, the four quesos blend. Um, I forgot why I got this. I had a recipe in my head and now I can't remember. But I got that. Once in a while when I don't feel like making my salsa, I will buy salsa from the little Mexican stores, uh, supermarkets in my area. Uh, and I'm gonna make tacos for breakfast. So I decided to get this because I'm not gonna sit here and make some salsa this morning like I'm I'm Mexican but I'm not feeling like that right now I got some eggs I got oh, I'm gonna show you that last I got some ground beef I got some bologna some weenies I got some avocado some sour cream um, and I got nutri leche hey! this milk is so good you don't even understand focus a product from Mexico I believe actually the flavor is so different from other milks um I get this for mr. CJ but I usually um, before I went keto I, I did drink a lot of this as well um, not a whole lot but and I just noticed that it just lasts a little longer than our milk um, but it's a super small container as you can see it's like the size of like a soy milk carton um, so for mr. CJ is perfect and last but not least I didn't get these at superior I drove to Albertson because I live in the hood and like <laughs> 
I wouldn't, I wouldn't change it any other way, but I don't have Vons or Elvis' super, super, super close, but I got low-carb tortillas. My sister has actually tried the whole wheat ones, but I haven't, so I got a pack for those to see if I like those. These are eight large size. They both have six gram of net carbs um, and about nine grams of fiber, and then this is the flour tortilla and I got a pack for my sis as well. Okay, I'm all ready to go and get my eye exam. I just took a quick shower and that's it. I didn't do my hair makeup because of course I am running late. Uh, I'm, so it's almost 3.30 and I am starving. Yes, I'm driving and I'm barely looking at the camera. I'm just holding it. But I do have to tell you guys, I should have pulled out my camera and should have shown you all exactly how this part car park i had a bus to miss and i had to go through my back seat and jump to my front seat it was really bad um but i did it and i should have pulled out the camera but i was too mad and i was ready to yell at that man and i'm just like no not today i don't want to do that today so i'm on my way home actually i lied i'm gonna go to whole foods i'm gonna get some water first refill my gallons that i have back here can you see them they've been in my car for a hot minute and it is starting to get hot and and, and you know and that's why i'm wearing a turtleneck because the weather here it's stupid it's stupid right now so i'm gonna take care of that first and then i'm gonna head over because i want to buy a uh, psyllium for I have you all up in my face i want to buy some psyllium for some uh keto bread recipes that i've been obsessing over on the youtubes as my mom likes to call it <laughs> Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to follow me on all my social media at I am Lolo. And don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>